Hello, I hope you are well. This is a follow-up video to one I made the other day showing a simple mask design. There were some sound quality issues with that one and I just wanted today to demonstrate an improved design using a vacuum cleaner bag. This HEPA filter bag appears to offer the best protection. So I would like to show you how to make this with the Hoover bags and continue behind the hashtag masks for all. In the past few days, there has been a lot of movement on the call to wear masks. They are compulsory in a number of countries. Some states in US are required residents to wear masks while out and about. Well, it's important to know that we now know from recent studies that a significant portion of individuals with coronavirus lack symptoms. They're what we call asymptomatic. And that even those who eventually become pre-symptomatic, meaning that they will develop symptoms in the future, can transmit the virus to others before they show symptoms. This means that the virus can spread between people interacting in close proximity. For example, coughing, speaking, or sneezing, even if those people were not exhibiting symptoms. In light of this new evidence, CDC recommends and the task force recommends wearing cloth face coverings in public, public settings where other social distancing measures are difficult to maintain. And the WHO, the World Health Organization, also advise everybody wearing masks. Again, I would like to promote the work of Peter Ludwig and Jeremy Howard. Um, and the links to the work can be found in the description below. Added to this is research published in Nature and research tech, uh, conducted by King College London, summarized in this MIT uh, technology review piece, which recommends that measures to contain viral spread should focus on transmission from people's mouth, nose. That could lend more weight to the argument in favor of wearing a mask or any face covering while in the public. Let's get started. We need a um, hover bag, something for you. I used 20 by 15 centimeters and a two elastic band. And I'm going to start with the A4 paper. I'm going to fold in half. Then six centimeters. Another six centimeters. So this is gonna be the nose bit. And then five centimeters. And then 10 centimeters. So this is from the nose to the corner of your eyes. And then came out a bit to having the elastic bands on for the ears. So this is 10 centimeters from there to there. From here, the top to the bottom is depends your size. This is your nose and your mouth and your chin and your neck. So the face mask basically cover from through the nose, middle of the nose and you take a measure tape, start from here and go all the way cover to definitely under the chin. So give a tiny bit more space under your chin. That's the lens you need from there to there. Mine is quite small because I got a little nose. So I am 15. So 15 is good for me, but for my husband, he need 18. So, or for my kids, I just need 12. So that's the lens. If it's too long, 
it's gone very loose for the end and I'm going to have a bigger lump there but if it's too tight obviously don't give you good enough protection and it got the air goes through so measure your own size from nose the middle of the nose to under the chin okay so then we're going to have a little nice curve join there from there to there and then for here I just going to imagine from near the ear and drawing a nice curve down to your chin so that's the face mask I'm going to cut it off make a nice curve for the connector bit I just use this because that's strong and it's already made and here I'm trying to get the corner as well draw a line use the pattern and again if you got a little bit fatty fat face you can make this a bit more round if you get very sharpy chin then you possibly you want to make a bit more inside so we all got different face and good thing about handmade is you make for your own and design for your own so I'm going to keep this bit And keep a tiny bit as well so that's the ear and here it needs to be open but from the nose bit stitch from there and then all the way there and then what you need is put this under this for one side and this this for another side and another one stick on there and then you will need this foil fold in half and in half again and then half okay then we can just put on the top So it takes about two minutes to make a mask if you got to hover back. Covered, covered, covered. And it's quite comfy inside as well. Got a lining. Hope you like it and enjoy making it yourself. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.